loves welcome back to my channel so today we're doing another house to home video i'm so excited to share with you guys our dining rooms so before we get started i wanted to show you guys some before and after photos so this is before before we moved in so this is what it looks like and then after doing some painting adding curtains and our furniture this is what it looks like <laughs> so adding curtains really kind of soften up the area a little bit more and then of course we had to change the light fixture or the chandelier in the dining room and this one is just so beautiful you guys i love it so 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 much and then after some more decorating this is what it looks like so going in from you know our hallway this is what you will see looking into the dining room so there's you know the bay windows and you can see the painting and everything so that's just an overview of it and this room is actually i mean it's not super big or anything like that it's right off of our kitchen so if you turn this is the kitchen and then looking in from the kitchen this is what you will see so there's cabinets here on the left side which is actually our pantry like it has everything i'm still in the process of organizing everything but here's a sneak peek of what it overall looks like at the moment i have baskets in there and all that jazz just to really keep it organized but yeah again i'm still in the process of it so i will do a whole separate video on that like pantry organization let me know if that's something you guys would like to see down below now our table is the same one that we had in our old house same with our chair so those are from Overstock and the table we found at Shopco, which is like a local store here And then this is what the table setting looks like at the moment. I'm still playing around with it I love my neutrals and I love playing with like different types of texture and Here is like where everything is from. So the ring is from Pier 1, the napkins from Target, the bowls from Pottery Barn, the plates from TJ Maxx and the placemat is also from TJ Maxx and then I found these candle holders from Joanne Fabrics and then the vase was from Pure One and if you're wondering the full flowers in the vase I found I believe a Hobby Lobby so that's that and then the painting I absolutely adore this I got it from Pure One it's just like my all-time favorite and the chandelier is actually from Amazon it's like the exact same one from Pottery Barn and I found it for so much cheaper on Amazon I was like blown away like i love it so much the curtains are from tj maxx and i love the pattern on them they're sheer with these really cute pattern i love it it lets a lot of sunshine in and yeah so that is pretty much it nothing too crazy in our dining room um it just took a while i don't know why but i'm glad that's done now i'm just gonna share with you guys a little bit of our kitchen as you can see this is our kitchen there's still quite a bit of things to be done but so far what we have done is you know cleaned everything um we got a microwave and then we installed these pendant lights instead of having recessed lighting up there we put in pendant lightings and then we also changed the recessed lighting they were like this really dingy white color before but now they're stainless steel or stainless whatever <laughs> so it matches our appliances and everything so that is what the kitchen looks like right now and this is actually like looking from the living room into the kitchen so we have this bar and the stools i love these stools i got them from hay needle and yeah that is pretty much it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it's super quick but that's pretty much it for our dining room um i can't wait to share with you guys more of our house so stay tuned and thank you guys for watching. I love you. Bye.